Hey guys, this is Dish Star Siren, and we're gonna build with The Sims 4. And the main idea of this house is going to be like a tent house. Basically, a house that completely looks like a tent. Like you guys went. Like, this is gonna be like the end of the summer kind of tribute. So. Yeah, this is going to look completely like a tent, hopefully, by the time I'm done. Or like a triangle with the house going to be in the middle of it. So, yeah. Let's get started. Uh, that's going to be the hardest part, is going to be making the... Like, it sounds easy, but in the end run, it... To me, it sounds a little tricky, so I'll probably have to make sure I get the roof down first before I put down the walls, just to know where my limit is. But yeah, I came up with this idea probably earlier today. Basically, you know the old school camping tents that basically all the kids used to go to camping and stuff with be in the past when we stayed in tents instead of cabins. That's the kind of idea I was hoping for. I was just smoothing out the glitches that we're getting right here. Hmm. Most of these are like bright blue. Hmm. There we go. I was Wanting a little bit of lights to be able to come through in here. Mainly for the fact of basically peop they will need to be able to see into there as well as out. But yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and get the blueprints in. Like maybe I feel this could be a good two bed, two bath kind of house. And there's going to be like a tent house. Like a family of four can easily stay in here. As well as. There we go. Bedroom. Kid room. Bedroom. Bathroom. Alright. Uh, I think the vintage glamour stuff pack. Kind of helps fit in with the actual theme of this house. Let's get started. Uh, let's start with the bedrooms because they're going to be a little bit easier. And with the kid room, I'll probably use, I don't know which pack I'm going to use it out of yet, but it's going to be either the parents, tr the family pack or the kid room pack. Um, suppose I didn't add in a flooring into it as well just to have that kind of mixture there we go mm. okay uh, they don't have a ceiling lamp that has like plants in it do they no probably use this one just to make it look like it's a candlelit house okay bathroom it's mainly going to be of the raw series in the bathroom. So, hold on, this will probably make it easier if we look at the word raw. Alright, and now the kids room. Which is going to be two beds. Which you can modify this for your family because they did add in like toddlers. Or even if you have an outdoor man and wife living starting to live together and everything this would actually work out for them too you would just have to modify the kids room to to actually match their needs like say they're starting a family so then you would need these bassinets or if if they are going into the toddler stage you'll probably need these I thought it was cars that the toddlers got. Um, I'm not seeing them. But here's one of the toddler's beds. But they also had one that looks like a car. And I'm 
not spotting that one. But um, they ask, or let's say their child, and they're moving, like, or you have a child, a teen, or let's say I grew up, but they're still living with you, and they actually gained your needs and wanted to live off the grid as well. Or at least a complete outdoorsy family. This would be perfect for them. So, yeah. Uh, I thought they had some, like, camper beds that were for, like, single bed things. Uh, there we go. And then the parents room bed. <laughs> All right. And then over here, what I was thinking was having a really small kitchen right here. Or even they could go outside and they cook the food, but they won't have that much space to cook it with. So I say they have a small kitchen here and then, yeah. So let's see. Let's see how well I could, that we could fit the um, kitchen and stuff in here. Um, trying to decide. Okay, so that doesn't really exit out. So we'll go ahead and move that a bit closer. And. Mm -hmm. There we go. That looks a little better. Okay. I. Uh, let's add in some decoration and then that will be it out of this house. Because it's mainly going to be like an outdoorsy house, so there's not really that much we could do with it. Um, was there an like, outdoor retreat? Because that will probably be it. Alright. If you guys like what you see, let me know. Oh, I forgot to do the dirt pathway to the house. Uh, more importantly, where's the mailbox at? Uh, I'm going right back into that habit. Mm -hmm. There it is. Alright, I think all we need now is like a mailbox. So let's... Alright. And here is the infamous tent house. If you guys like what you see, let me know. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.